Welcome to the F.Bentley CAD Essentials Training. This course covers the basic essentials of the F.SS4 workspace, which can be used with MicroStation V8i Select Series 4, with or without Geopack V8i Select Series 4, or alternatively with Power Geopack V8i Select Series 4. Most F.District CAD machines utilize Power Geopack V8i Select Series 4, since it exists as a single installation with the features of both MicroStation and Geopack. Consequently, during this course, I may interchangeably refer to F.SS4, MicroStation, and Power Geopack. This course was developed to introduce MicroStation users to the V8i Select Series 4 Essentials tools for the design and development of Florida Department of Transportation projects. The intent is to cover the basics and give the user a general knowledge of MicroStation with FDOT's customization to assist the user in producing a product that is in compliant with the FDOT computer-aided design and drafting standards. This chapter reviews the MicroStation design environment within the Florida Department of Transportation FDOT workspace. Special consideration is given to MicroStation design files, FDOT seed files, launching MicroStation or Power Geopack in the FDOT workspace, file open in the FDOT workspace, F.Discipline discipline configurations, creating files in the F.Discipline workspace, design file settings, F.Discipline preferences, MicroStation help and support, as well as F.Discipline help and support. The MicroStation V8i format is a subset of the DGN file format used by previous versions of MicroStation and the DWG file format used by AutoCAD. This gives MicroStation native support for both products as well as the DXF format. A design file, often referred to as a design, is a container for smaller containers called models. Each model consists of graphical elements such as arcs, lines, and circles. Each model is a unique drawing within the design file which allows multiple drawings to reside in the same design file. For example, a roadway design, profiles, and plan and profile sheets can exist as separate models in a single design file. Each MicroStation design file is created from a seed file. A seed file is a previously stored design file with user-specified settings used as a template to create a new DGN. The Florida Department of Transportation has created seed files for use in production and have standard settings stored in them. Available seed files for FDOT's purposes include 2D and 3D seed files, key map and cross-section seed files, as well as right-of-way and structure seed files. FDOT has created and provided a custom workspace to standardize the MicroStation environment for agency use. This workspace determines how MicroStation displays on the screen and sets up certain default files and search paths. FDOT's customized MicroStation workspace can be launched by the following common avenues. Locate the F.SS4 folder on the desktop. Depending on what application you have loaded, you'll see a F.SS4 for Power Geopack icon, or an F.SS4 for MicroStation with and without Geopack icons. Your installed applications are detected by F.SS4 during installation, and the appropriate icon is created in the folder. In this case, I have Power Geopack loaded, so I have an icon that says F.SS4 for Power Geopack. To launch the workspace, simply double click on the icon. Another option for launching the F.SS4 workspace is to select the Windows Start button, if it's still called the Start button, locate the F.SS4 program group, and select the appropriate F.SS4 icon. When MicroStation or Power Geopack launches without a specified design file, a File Open dialog will display. File Open is used to manage design files, performing file-related tasks, such as creating and opening drawings. The file open dialog contains standard navigation tools such as a drive list and file list. Selecting a file from the central window displays a preview of the selected file on the right hand side. Right clicking on a design file opens a drop down menu with file options for use on the selected file. Other features to be aware of in the File Open dialog include the User, Project, and Interface drop-down menus. The User drop-down menu sets user configuration variables. This component, in effect, points to the active workspace's project and interface components. 
The user name identifies the user configuration file, or UCF, which is stored in the f.ss4 workspace users directory. This should default to f.ss4. Project sets the project configuration variables specific to a certain project, such as path location of files. A project consists of customized data files identified by configuration variables in the project configuration file, PCF, which is stored in the eProjects directory, or whatever projects directory you have your project stored in. The drop-down list views all projects created that have a PCF file and defaults to the last project opened. If no projects have been previously created, then this will default to no project. Interface sets the active user interface. FDOT has a customized user interface defined in a DGN library that is stored in the local F.SS4 Workspace Interfaces Microstation directory. This should default to F.SS4. Once a DGN file is open, users can switch to another DGN file by selecting the Microstation menu option, File Open, or by holding down the Control key and selecting the letter O. The Open dialog displays as a set of abbreviated file open options. To navigate to a different directory, select the directory from the directories list in the middle of the dialog. To open a design file, select it from the files list and click Open, or double click on the file name to open it. The f.cad software is delivered with configurations within the f.workspace which dictate discipline-specific f.menu options, file specification, and resource files for each of the f.standards for roadway, structures, right-of-way, utilities, and photogrammetry disciplines. Users may change the appropriate configuration while in MicroStation from the f.menu option, Standard, Configuration. This is the f.menu configuration dialog. As you can see, you can select the standard menu, different discipline options, as well as survey features and utility features. The structures menu allows you to also select additional discipline menus such as geotechnical or roadway. There's also a right-of-way configuration and photogrammetry configuration. After you've selected the menus that you'd like to use, simply click on the Update Menu option in the bottom right corner. You can also dismiss the dialog by clicking the Exit button. If you select the Update Menu option, it will close MicroStation and you'll need to restart the f.ss4 workspace. Creating Files in the f.workspace while standard MicroStation tools can be used to create new files, FDOT provides the utility to create new files with the correct seed file and file naming convention already in place. This tool can be accessed from the Actions menu, Create File. A previous version of this tool was able to be launched from within MicroStation or outside of MicroStation. Currently, this tool is for use within MicroStation only or Power Geopack. A brief tour of this dialog. The first drop down menu, entitled Project, allows you to select your active project. It'll populate any project that's listed in your projects folder and has a PCF file or project configuration file. If you do not see the project that you'd like to use, you can select the project and browse for it. The second menu is the Discipline menu. You can select what discipline the file is in that you're creating. For example, Roadway. Certain disciplines have additional file groups. For example, Roadway has construction files, drainage files, EMO files, lighting, roadway, signal, etc. When you select a file group, you'll see the individual files that belong in that file group, the base file name, and a description. If a file with the same name already exists in your project, this application will automatically create a file using the next available sequence number. For example, I already have an Align RD01, so the application will create an Align RD02. 
you'll see the application does list the output folder. You can browse to change the output folder. However, the standard correct output folder will be listed in this field. The seed file field lists the seed file that will be used to create the new file. You can browse and change the seed file, but we do recommend sticking with the standard seed file for the appropriate file name. You can select the county that your project is in from this drop-down. This will set the coordinate system, and the coordinate system is listed right here. The action field lists the 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 action field lists the actions or commands that will be run on the file after it is opened. The previous version of this dialog allowed you to continuously create files without opening them. This dialog, the new Create File 2.0, uh, makes it so that you have to open the file after you create it. That's so that these commands can be run. The basic commands typically for most files are to set the plot scale. But in the case of some files, it creates additional models. You'll notice with the align RD, there's a command here that's going to create several models within the file for the alignment at different scale. We'll talk more about models later. Design file settings. When a new design file is created, it is recommended to review the setup of the design file parameters that control how the drawing functions. The most common file settings are found in the design file settings dialog, which provides control over such settings as highlight colors, coordinate readout, and grid settings. To access design file settings, select the MicroStation menu option, Settings, Design File. It is important to note that if the proper seed file is used when the MicroStation file is created, then there should be no need to change any of the design file settings. One of the design file settings options is Working Units. Working Units consists of controls that are used to set real-world units of measurement for design models. MicroStation recognizes metric and English units, either of which may be selected. Additionally, users can create their own custom units by relating them to the standard units, metric or English. Changing between the units used in a model makes no difference to the size of the geometry in the model. Alternatively, changing the resolution settings in the advanced settings does change the size of the existing geometry in the model. In practice, the resolution setting will rarely, if ever, have to be changed from the default. You'll notice the default f dot resolution is 304,800 per distance survey foot. Global origin. The global origin for FDOT's standard seed files are set to XY coordinate of 00. zero. The global origin can be relocated to specific coordinate values to create a custom coordinate system. When using create file to create microstation files, a predefined seed file is used to create each design file automatically and thus, the global origin is set to the F dot standard of 00. zero. The preferences can be accessed from Workspace, Preferences on the MicroStation menu. If we look at the Operation section of the Preferences dialog, you'll notice one of the options is Compress File on Exit. When elements are deleted from a MicroStation design file, the elements no longer display in the design, but a record of the deleted elements remains in the design file. The Compress Design File command removes these records, which reduces the file size. The Undo buffer is cleared when a design file is compressed, so after compressing, the user will no longer be able to undo any previous operations. If Compress File on Exit is selected, this compression will be run every time a file is closed. This used to be more important when file size was a consideration, so this is a optional preference. I'm going to go ahead and set this to Compress File on Exit. Another option you'll notice in the Preferences dialog is Automatically Save Design Changes. By default, this is enabled. As you're drawing in a MicroStation file, all of your changes will be automatically saved as they are created. We recommend leaving this enabled. All of these preferences are saved in the f.ss4 UPF file or user preference file which is located on your local drive regardless of whether you have a standalone workstation installation or a client server installation of the f.ss4 software. MicroStation help and support or Power Geopack help and support. There are a number of ways to find help with MicroStation and Power Geopack. Just like any Windows application you can access the help from the help menu. There's a quick start guide as well as a standard Windows help file dialog. 
you'll notice that Bentley has not updated the help file in quite a bit. This still says Select Series 3, despite the fact that we're running a Select Series 4 product. For more real-time help, you can access Connect Advisor. Connect Advisor is a tool that provides contextual help as well as training. If I select a tool and go to the contextual option, Connect Advisor will show the help file for Place Smart Line, which is the tool I've selected, as well as a video that discusses the Place Smart Line feature. This is a great resource for finding training. Connect Advisor also gives you access to Bentley Learn, the communities page where you can discuss Bentley related topics, and Bentley's YouTube page. The drop down menu under general allows you to select most recent articles, search results, quick starts, upcoming events, and news and announcements. But what about support for F.Users? users? There are a number of options for support. If you go to the f.ss4 folder on the desktop, you can find a link to the previously mentioned Bentley CAD support community. F. does have its own section of the Bentley communities. You can double click on this icon to request support through the f.cad office sharewell issue log. You can submit a ticket and say I'm having a problem with this issue or that issue and we will get back to you with uh, someone who can assist you with that problem. There's also an icon for CAD GoToMeeting. If you contact the CAD office or if the CAD office responds to your support request and we say we need to do a GoToMeeting, you can double click on the CAD GoToMeeting icon and it will take you to a page where you can enter the meeting ID number that we give you so that you can connect to our GoToMeeting and we can provide you support. Additionally, throughout the F.Menu, menu there are help links to the left of the items on the F.Menu. menu. These help links will open up a help article in a browser on that topic. That is the end of chapter one of the F.Bentley CAD Essentials.